Hey guys, it's me, Make It All Maniac, and I'm here with another eBay haul. Now this is going to be a smaller than my past eBay hauls, because, ta-da, I got a pool brush. It's a 10-inch pool brush. A couple of the bristles are a little bent, but that's okay. These are about, I think they were $7.99 or $8.99 on Walmart for the plastic ones, and I got this for $5.19. It only took a couple of days to ship to me. It was bought within the U.S., so, yeah. Can't wait to use that. I need it so bad. And, as usual, if there's something that I'm showing here that you want more information on, who the seller was, blah, 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 just ask me and I'll tell you. All right, I got a cute watermelon shirt for my girls. This is a medium. It's kind of big on mom. So I've ordered a small already so hopefully it'll hurry up and get here before the watermelon festival so I can march my little girls around watermelon festival time in their cute little rockin' watermelon t-shirts. So can't wait for the small one to get here. And speaking of the watermelon festival, I got this large referee shirt because um, I had they Flash didn't go the year that we had this costume. We did the Melon Mutts, which was a football watermelon dog thing, and I was a referee. I wanted Flash to be a referee, but he was sick. The little boy pups, well, they're not pups anymore, but what were the pups? The, the um, two boys, they are football players. Was it two? No, sorry, my bad. The three little boys. I cannot count today. Hello. The three little boys were football players. Um, they had shorts and shirt jerseys with the, the Melon Mutts logo. They each had their name on the back of their shirt. And my two girls were cheerleaders. And they had pom-poms that hung from their shoulders. So when they ran, it looked like they were cheering. And So now Daddy can be a referee. Then... For Exy, I um, got this police canine unit shirt. It's kind of sheer, so in the summer it won't be real hot. But this was too little. What usually, he usually fits a medium, and this medium is like a small. So, I ordered a large, and it fits him perfectly, because with this one he had like wrinkles, and it made him look like really bad back fat, so... Mama had to turn around and get him a new shirt, so I got now. Now little trippers or Tink can have a little one in XE. I got I got some police dog shirt, and I finally got a third tie. And this one's a leopard one for the dogs. I've won a fourth one. It's red with white polka dots, but it's not here yet. So now I actually have an actual tie for all four of the boys. But I also started collecting bow ties. This one's sprinkled in the package. I gotta flatten back out, but there is a black one, and all of these are sizable and they have little clips. So here's the first of the bow ties to show up. And this oh my goodness. Check this out, guys. This is a lion's mane for my animals. It fits cats and small dogs. Now Tink runs around in this, but my cat, he just kept looking at the ground and flicking his head all over like, oh gosh, get this off me. Get this off me. So yeah, maybe I'll video the cat one day wearing his lion mane, but I pretty much got that for my dog. <laughs> she wears anything for her mama. I got ten of these, and they are four-leaf clover charms. Aren't they so cute? And I got ten of those. I think they were, if I remember correctly, I think I only paid like 12 or 30 cents or real cheap for them. So yay! I now have four-leaf clover charms. And these, I could not believe. 
I won them individually. They're handcrafted glass, and they are meant to fit European charm bracelets. And this is a colorful, tealy, actually a bluish green bird with a red head, orange beak, red feet. It actually stands so he can hang out while he's not on my bracelet. But there's a tropical parrot. I'm scared to kind of put him on the bracelet. I think he would get broken, but I don't know. He was cute, and I had to have him. And same with this Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. He, too, is uh, one of them hand glass figures for the European Charm Bracelet. He stands up, too. So, had to have those. And as usual, I'll finish off with stamping plates. To start off, I got Cute Girl 001. There's computer buttons. Yes, no. Little like asterisk starry things. Pointer finger. There's a computer monitor. Girl Q001. Girl Q005. I love these anchors right here. And I'm not really sure what those are. Scratches, little teardrops, kitty face. Hello. Q Girl 031. It's just tribal stuff. Those are like tribal eyes and some flowers, a moon. Q Girl 32. More tribal. I love that lizard. It's like a tribal wizard looking skeleton, some bird heads, that looks like a dragon, that looks like a dragon. Q Girl 33, it's just like different tribal ribbons and two little tribal medallions. And again, that's 33. Q Girl 34 is just the alphabet and a couple different sizes going around the circle. Number 35. Oh, that alphabet was 34. Number 35 is like lace and it's got hearts in it. And so does that. The little circle right there has got hearts in it. JQ 27. I am so so in love with this peacock. There's keyboard, a couple of other different patterns. I have good luck with the JQ series and the Q girl. JQ 29, there's an owl, an umbrella, hearts, almost looks like lattice, flower. Hee <laughs> hee 21, this is like a kitty plate. There's Kitties and heads and paw prints. Kitty heads even smaller and fish bones. All fish bones. Swirly, curly cute things and paw prints. I thought even with, you know, none of this stuff, just paw prints. I could rock that at the dog show. Hee hee 21. And I have really good luck with these heart-shaped plates. There's a girl and an acoustic guitar on music and some flowers. Here's number one trying to get the whole set to those because I really like them. Next is COOI dash 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 zero zero seven. It's just different like little paisleys and curly cues and whatnot. I think I have number one to this series too. Alright. <clears throat> I I've got a couple of this series, and so far I've not had any luck with them. It is the plates with the numbers TU before the numbers. Here's number 1 and number 24. I've not tried these different patterns on number 1, but I have tried this 24, and I think 22 was the one with the minions, and I cannot get them to work. Has anyone tried these TU series? Um, let me know. And my last plate to haul, um, now these are the Helens. 
This is Helen number one. There's a pattern of butterflies, circles, looks like block, a hummingbird, dandelions, a heart, um, some kind of flower, a heron in a flower and a face. I've had good luck with the Helen, so now I got Helen number one. But I do believe that's all I have to show you in this eBay haul. So, hope y'all are doing well and have a good day. And bye!